Hey, it's Carrie Legend, and I'm going to show you today how to use my Canva bundle templates. So regardless of what set that you get, you're going to receive a text file, which looks like this. And this is like, um, this is the hexagon set, for example. And I have some instructions in here along with all the links that are down below. So um, it says, hey there, thanks for downloading this template. Below is the link that you'll need in Canva. And so a few important things. Um, be sure to make a copy of the template design first before you start editing, as Canva will not save your changes without doing that first. And your opening is my template file. And if you make changes to that, then you're changing my template and not making changes to your own document. So it's not going to save on your Canva account. It's just going to continue to change the template, which will impact the experience for other customers. So let's not do that. Make sure you make a copy first. Okay, so then what I would recommend is putting everything in a folder, like I have mine as uh, legend templates, and that way you can pull them um, whenever you want to use them in a design. So I have all of my templates in here in this folder. And let's say that we want to create like an ebook or something. So we'll go over here and say create design. And we'll do, let's see. I just want to find like an eight and a half by 11 document. So we'll just do a letter. And what this is going to do is it's going to bring up a blank um, blank document and we're going to go over to our folders where we saved the templates and we're just going to drag in what we need. Instead of like taking the template and deleting all the pages, instead just save it in a folder and then you can drag and drop what you need. All right, so let's see, I want, want the cover set. So we'll create a cover. I like this one. All right, and now I'm ready to edit and I don't have to worry about deleting anything. I can just yank from over here. And then you can add a new page. And I think I'll grab maybe the, the about page set or the welcome set. This is a good one. I like that layout. Okay, so so far I've got my cover, I got my welcome, um, and now I need to go into like uh, the magazine interiors. And let's see. That's the Insta story. Pinterest. Oh, we can grab some cheat sheets while we're in here. All right, so I'll grab that one. Um, I also need a thank you set. Let's see, that's the blush one. A worksheet but you get the idea you can um, choose the pages that you need to actually use so that way you're not deleting anything and that's the key don't delete um, you know something that you paid for so um, this is the fastest way to kind of get a document going um, you can do the same with like different social media sets that I've made for you um, if there's uh, different designs that you like and you want to create like a cohesive look um, with the layouts that I've put in, you can kind of see which ones match each other. And then you can pull those in and uh, do them all at once. And I'll, you can also resize them to other sizes too. So that is how to use these templates and not wreck the template for other people and also save your work at the same time so you don't lose it. So I hope that helps and um, I know that you'll enjoy them. I I use these all the time. Uh, it really cuts down on the amount of time that I spend um, getting materials together. And um, when I'm doing my course writing for other people, these are the templates that I like to use. These are my favorites. 
Um, and it just makes everything really fast and it looks really good. So I hope you enjoy them. If you have any questions, let me know. Thanks.